A 1,686 map of Berlin and neighboring cities with Köln labeled B and highlighted in yellow. Neighborhoods in Berlin Mitte, Old Köln, Alt Berlin, Friedrichswerder, Neukölln. Mwasser, Dorotheenstadt, Friedrichstadt, Luisenstadt, Strelauerverstadt, Alexanderplatz area. Spandauerverstadt, Friedrich Wilhelmstadt, Iranienbergerverstadt, Rosenthalerverstadt Köln was the twin city of Old Berlin from the 13th century to the 18th century. Köln was located on the Fischer Island section of Spree Island, opposite Alt Berlin on the western bank of the River Spree, until the cities were merged by Frederick I of Prussia to form Berlin in 1710. Today, the former site of Köln is the historic core of the modern Mita locality of the Berlin Mita borough in central Berlin. Köln, Bruderstrasse and Street. Peter in the 19th century, by Edward Gartner Köln is first mentioned in a 1237 deed, denoting a priest Simeon of Köln St. Peter's Church as a witness. This date is commonly regarded as the origin of Berlin, though Alt Berlin on the eastern bank of the Spree River was not mentioned before 1244 and parts of modern Greater Berlin, such as Spandau and Kupenik, are even older. Köln and Alt Berlin were separated only by the River Spree, linked by the Molendam Causeway, hence there was a close connection right from the start. Since the trade route from Magdeburg to Frankfurt crosses the Twin Town and the inland water transportation routes also pass through it, Köln Berlin quickly came to prosperity. A second crossing, the Langbrücke, Today the Rathaus Brook was erected across the Spree in 1307 with a common town hall in the middle of it. The common policy of Berlin and Köln led 1307 to a first alliance with other towns in Salzwedel, in the march to defend their rights against the sovereign. The elector Frederick II Iron Tooth of Brandenburg ended the autonomy of Köln slash Berlin and declared the twin town to his residence in 1451. In 1710 the twin cities Köln and Old Berlin merged by the order of King Frederick I to form the capital of Prussia. As Alt Berlin was twice as big as Köln at that time, the merged city was named Berlin. The name of Köln survives in the Berlin southeastern borough of Neukölln. Originally a southern extension of Köln was called Neukölln am Wasser, and the Kölnischer Park and the Street and Kölnischen Park are both located in the adjacent area. The Barenswinger enclosure situated within the park was until 2015 home to three brown bears, representing the cradle of the city. Nikolaus Staatsrat building Ribbickhaus Jungfern Brook Köln Center the St. Peter's Church, originally built about 1,230 and reconstructed several times over the centuries, had been badly damaged by air raids in the Battle of Berlin in 1945. It was finally demolished in 1964. The church bore its name because many of Köln's inhabitants depended on fishing. Today only the name of the Petroplatz Square marks the site. From here the Bruderstrasse runs north, named after the brothers of a former Dominican monastery established in 1297. Though most of the neighborhood was destroyed, a few Baroque houses remained, the bookseller Christoph Friedrich Nikolai lived on Bruderstrasse 13 from 1787 until his death in 1811. Today the house is still called Nikolai House, it was erected about 1670 and had belonged to the merchant Johann Ernst Gotzkowski from 1747 to 1773. Nikolai had it remodeled by the mason and composer Karl Friedrich Selter, making it a meeting point of intellectuals influenced by the Age of Enlightenment and Romanticism movement. In 1786 owner Ray Mirabeau stayed here on his first trip to Berlin and so did the architect Karl Friedrich Schinkel, the sculptor Johann Gottfried Schadow, the printmaker Daniel Chodowiecki as well as the poet Theodor Korner in 1811. Korner's father Christian Gottfried Korner lived here as a Prussian privy councillor from 1815 to 1828. On Bruderstrasse 10 stands the Galgene House, built about 1688. According to legend, a maidservant was hanged right in front of the house in 1735, being falsely accused of stealing a silver spoon. From 1742 on the building belonged to the early statistician Johann Peter Sussmilch, at this time provost of the St. Peter's Church. The neighboring building, built in 1905, is home of the Berlin representation of the federal state of Saxony. Nearby the Sperling's gas branches off, where the novelist Wilhelm Rabe lived from 1854 to 1856 and published his popular work Die Chronik der Sperling's Gas. The small alley, at this time the Spree Gas, was renamed in 1931 on occasion of the author's 100th anniversary. All former buildings on this street were demolished about 1960. The northern part of the Bruderstrasse today is covered by the 1964 building of the former Staatsrat of the German Democratic Republic. The facade at the Schlossplatz Square includes the preserved portal no. 
four of the demolished Hohenzollern city palace, where Karl Liebknecht on November 9, 1918 declared a free socialist republic of Germany. After German reunification the building served as the chancellery from 1999 to 2001. Today it houses the European School of Management and Technology and the Herdy School of Governance. The area north of the Schlossplatz is the site of the historic city palace and of the 1976 Palace der Republik. In accordance with a 2002 resolution by the federal Bundestag Parliament, the city palace is currently being rebuilt. Parallel to the Bruderstrasse runs the Breiterstrasse, Kolm's Main Street. At the corner of the Schlossplatz are the buildings of the old and the new Marstall riding stables of the electors of Brandenburg, built in 1670 and 1901. Today the new Marstall is a seat of the Hans Eisler Conservatory. On neighboring Breiterstrasse 35 is the late Renaissance Ribbick House from 1624, one of Berlin's oldest preserved residential buildings, which since 1920 houses the Central and Regional Library. Three historic bridges connect Köln with the 17th-century extension of Friedrichswerder on the western bank of the Spree River, the Schlusenbrück at the Schlossplatz, a steel construction. Erected in 1916, the Gertrudenbrück with the statue of St. Gertrude of Nivelle by the sculptor Rudolf Siemering from 1896 and the small Jungfernbrück built in 1798. Berlin's oldest and the only bascule bridge of the city. Media related to Kulnit Wikimedia Commons. Thanks for watching.